Hi, Judy from Witch Peace Craft. Well, today in Australia, it is Sunday the 7th of July and time for my Tim Tam Draw giveaway. The Tim Tam Draw giveaway was in the spirit, done in the spirit of having a bit of fun in a Yarni community that wasn't yarn. In no way was it sponsored by Arnott's. I purchased the products myself that will be in the giveaway. I just need to get that in there for you, Jude. I have done the giveaway and it's on screen. I sort of screen saved it. Um, but before I show you who won, I have a few things I'd like to say. This week, I've been very disappointed in our Yarni community. Crystal from Crystal's Crochet and Stuff started a bag along cowl ages ago on a platform she thought would be suitable. And as it's progressed, and towards the end, it's deteriorated. I saw her video this week where she said she threw in the towel. She got lots of nasty emails and comments and it just took not the wind out of her. Now, I've been following this cow because I enjoy seeing what people create. I know I got a big kick out of seeing Kerry from Kerry's Down the Rabbit Hole make her first bag. And that's what a cow is about having some fun and stepping outside your comfort zone. And then what happens? It deteriorates. Why? Politics. I started my channel six months ago because I live in a small community and the only group we had fell apart because of politics. I don't think politics should enter our community. We're just a crafting community. I don't care what craft you do. And I will switch off or leave a live chat when they start on politics. I don't want to know. I have my opinions. You're entitled to your opinions. And sometimes the two never meet. And that's the way of the world. I was disappointed for Crystal because organising a cow takes time. And you do it with the best of intentions, like I did my Tim Tam giveaway. With the best of intentions of having a bit of fun. And towards the end, she just wanted it over with. And won't do another cow and I think that's really sad I hope in time when she heals a little she will do another cow and I'll be there to enter I'm going to make a point of that so Crystal in a few months time consider doing another cow mate don't let people get you down I know Crystal from bag a day receives really nasty emails after announcing the winner of each giveaway she showed on Facebook how a subscriber count goes up and drops straight after she announces the giveaway. We don't do giveaways to attract subscribers. It doesn't work. Mine will drop by at least five, I guarantee, after I announce the winner. It's always the way. And you can't control that. There are people out there who just enter giveaways. Every giveaway they see, that's the way it is. And it doesn't matter whether you, you try and hide it mid-video or word it differently. They're out there searching. That's the way of YouTube. So if we are a kind, caring community and we have our sister's backs or brother's backs, like we say, please head over to Crystal's Crochet and Stuff. I'll leave a link to her channel in the description below. Check out her channel. If there's something there for you you enjoy, subscribe. She's really talented. She has a lovely family and she has a genuine heart. So please check out her channel. Tell her you're a Yarny sister and that you're there to support her, not knock her down. Thanks guys, if you do that, I'd appreciate it. You know, Krista from Secret Yarnery in a live chat said, you have to have a thick skin when you start a channel, but there will always be that one comment that just rips you apart and you stew on for days and it upsets you. Now, I'm in two live chats this week where I've had the wind knocked out of me by comments made at me from people who don't even know me. I'm a name on a live chat. Yeah, I have a channel. You know that much about me. You don't know a lot. And I don't know what was in my comment to provoke such a reaction. I know the last one was because I'm old and I'm not technologically apt. And you know, when I went to school, I learned on a manual typewriter not even an electric typewriter. I'm 62 years old and I've been to the school of hard knocks and I consider myself to have the skin of a rhino. But Christopher from Secret Rowney is right. 
even though I have received nasty comments and emails that are really just why, why? And that's what I was like this week. Why am I in live chats to be attacked by a nasty comment? I'll just get up and leave. They won't even know they've got to me. But there you have it. If we are a kind, caring community, then let's start practicing. Leave politics and your opinions outside YouTube. They don't need to be in our group. I think we should take greater care to listen to Jane from Scraptastic, who tells us at every video end to choose kindness, because I think we're forgetting to choose kindness. And as Crystal from Bag o Day says, if you've got nothing nice today, don't send an email and say you're going to unsubscribe. Just unsubscribe. Because at the end of the day, if you're not happy with what you're watching, leave it. I mean, if there's something on TV I don't want to watch, I change channels. That's the way it is. I don't subscribe to every channel on YouTube. I do subscribe to a lot of Yanni ones because I enjoy them. But that's the way it is. So guys, I'd appreciate it if you do go over to Crystal's Crochet and Stuff and check out her channel. I think it'd be a nice thing to do after she's had a rough couple of weeks. So before I show you the draw, the reason I've done it this way is, well, the first person to come out was Janet LePray, and she didn't want to be entered. I forgot to take her out. Now there's a person with a really kind heart. Generous, kind heart. I would send her Tim Tams every week if she wanted them. She's such a lovely person. The second person to come out, and I just copied, is another really kind, generous lady. And that is, I don't know if you can see that. I've got to try and stop it flaring. It is Crafts by The Rose Tina. I don't always catch her lives because of time difference. I think I've made one. I'm usually trying to catch up on sleep. But she has, she is a lovely lady. I'm trying to be able to see why it won't do that. I just want to read out her comment. Hi, Judy. Wow. I hope they know a lot of people. I hope they, they'll know a lot of people enter this contest. Give me a, it will give me a better chance to win she's hoping not a lot of people will enter i can't really read it's quite small i should have done it before i've never tried the items you say but i hope i win them because i really enjoy trying things i've never had and the chance to try different stuff from different countries there you have it crafts by the rose tina's lovely check out her channel i really like her it's sad that we have so many lovely people in our community, but a small handful can destroy someone and make them feel so bad. And I don't know what pleasure people get out of being so unkind. I'm really happy it's crossed by the heroes. That has made me feel a lot better um, because I know her. Look, I think I know a bit about her and I do watch her channel. But at the end of the day, there were 59 unique comments and all of these people entered in the spirit of fun. So I thank you for doing that. If you're a loyal subscriber, I hope you enjoyed this. If you want me to do another Tim Tam giveaway, give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments. I might stretch the budget to another one. Thank you for watching. In the words of Jane from Scraptastic, please choose kindness. It's really important. You don't know what someone else is going through when you send stuff that upsets them even more. So have a crafty day until next time, which will be later today because I have a video to upload of Emma receiving her Dirt Girl doll that Billy, the crafty Floridian, sent her. Another lady with a big, kind, generous heart. For her to send a doll... Halfway across the world for a little girl she hardly knows blew me away. So when I'm feeling more upbeat, which this is done now, Crafts by the Rose, I will upload the video. It'll only be brief. But Billy, thank you so much. Goodbye and thanks for watching.